it's gonna be a video called uh, I bet you didn't know that <laughs> the secret of lenses yes 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 I've got a small pile of Zeiss lenses uh, most Zeiss lenses are not made in Germany Jawohl, Deutschland anymore they're, <laughs> they're made in Japan um, in the casino plant anyway the secret recipe is uh, kept over there. So um, this is, by the way, this is this is a this is a damn expensive lens here. This is the 35 millimeter f1.4 Distagon, and it is heavier than a boat anchor. <laughs> One thousand nine hundred dollars. Damn, you can buy a good used car for how much this lens costs. And that girlfriend is no lie. Very expensive. So what is the secret? Now, um, it used to be kind of back in the old days, like Grandma would uh, collect uh, a crystal, you know, a lead crystal uh, glassware, and like uh, you would never uh, eat or drink with it. It would always like stay up inside the uh, glass cabinet, but it, it was really heavy and it had a certain shimmer to it, and uh, it's a lead crystal. The secret, folks, and you can actually find this, but I knew it without even finding it. The secret uh, of Zeiss lenses, one of the secrets, one of the main secrets anyway, is, <clears throat> here it is, lead. That stuff that they make bullets out of, that stuff is, uh, that is uh, depleted uranium after millions of years. By the way, most lead is depleted uranium. Yeah, that's a fact. Look it up. Uh, so, the secret of Zeiss lenses, and you can see it if you know various types of, there's a lot of different types of glass. Um, but the secret of current, and there is an exception, like European, Europeans are like totally anal about anything that can cause you cancer. Just totally bat crap insane anal. But there is one, there is, well there's several exceptions, but there's one exception uh, for lead in the, uh, the production of consumer products and that is for optical instruments and lenses. I've even got the really freaking stupid uh, government document that gives a section and subsection for it. Um, but yeah, the secret ingredient in Zeiss lenses is lead. Maybe it's recycled bullets. No, <laughs> it's probably not. Uh, there are actually certain isotopes. There are many isotopes. That, there's one isotope of lead that is uh, used in like aerospace industry and like commercial satellites. It has unique properties, and that uh, isotope of lead is insanely expensive. It, I, I never knew about that until not too very long ago. There's like some shipwreck, and these people risk their lives uh, to get, and there are all these lead bars there. It's like, who the hell is going to you know, dive uh, endless feet and you know, spend hundreds of thousands of dollars? You know, gold coins I could see, but it was for lead bars. But this wasn't ordinary lead, folks. This was uh, the magical, rare, uh, and super expensive lead isotope that uh, NASA and uh, Russians and other people that need it for building uh, million-dollar satellites, they go, oh, yeah, baby, we got to have it. <laughs> they don't use that sort of lead in these lenses, but they use a specific isotope of lead that has unique... See, everything is electrical, and if you think that light is a bunch of photons or it's a transverse electric... See... A lens, and I've said this in like about 50 videos, a lens is an electrical circuit. There are a lot of elements in there. Anybody wants to argue this with me, I'm not going to mince bones with you. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll proverbially, I mean, I will, you know, you, <laughs> you know, you're debating the wrong person. You're sticking your head inside the alligator's mouth if you want to have a debate with me about uh, a lens as an electrical uh, circuit. It's exactly what it is. Um... That's the reason they dope these lenses with niobium, um, lanthanum dioxide, and all these other uh, rare earth elements. But Zeiss uses a couple of other things uh, for their ED elements. But the main ingredient in Zeiss lenses, it changes the dielectric permittivity of the light that passes through it. So it changes uh, chromatic aberration, it changes color saturation, it does all sorts of good things. So that's the secret, folks, of these really expensive... Other than, obviously, you know, high quality of manufacture. I mean, all of that stuff is important, too. Obviously, no duh. I'm not talking about that. But the secret is lead. And uh, 
There is something that you did not know, but now you know. You probably didn't want to know that, but... <laughs> oh, well. I thought it was neat. I love stuff like that. Okay?